this could be us So back to what I was saying <laughs> Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. We're back in World Defenders and today we have a new update actually. We are going to be taking down this new boss. His name is Moonclaw. Look at this boss. Like, it looks so good. And it's the new planet that they just released right now. I believe it's the planet... Okay, this was Zorbon, of course. And, okay, the planet's over here. Let me see what... It's called Planet Galaxia. So that's the new planet that we're going to be uh, seeing a lot more now because we've already taken down these three bosses. If you guys haven't seen that video on those three bosses, I advise that you go check it out, you guys. Um, they're a lot of fun to try to beat. You guys go and watch those videos. But today we're going to be doing the Moonclaw boss. Something else I wanted to mention is that with the Moonclaw comes another tower that I know. Its name is Shadowclaw. So I've been grinding a lot to get this tower and no i didn't plan this but its name is moonclaw and i thought it would be a really good idea to use the tower uh called shadowclaw it's a pretty good tower look at that so there it is it's uh, the shadowclaw tower it does 7500 and then times the two so that does about fifteen thousand, and you can place up to two that's 30,000 damage. So I think that's really good. You guys are going to be able to see that. Uh, hopefully when we beat this boss. As well. I got this new money bag spec. Guys this cost me 5,000 coins. Like that's a lot of money. And it looks like the Monopoly guy. The Monopoly guy. You guys know that from the board game Monopoly. That's what he looks like. And with it came the money blaster. So let me go over here. There we go. It's the Money Blaster right here. It's probably the best blaster in the game at the moment. I'll show you guys. When it reloads, it sounds like the register. And when it blasts, it sounds like coins. So it's like, it's pretty cool. I really like it. It's fully golden. I also wanted to show you guys my new suit. So we go to Champions. And then we go to Skins. If you look at this suit, boom. Look at my suit. So this is the Starlight Cosmic sentinel it looks really cool i like the blue and the pink and it just really looks really nice and look i also have the pet of moon claw i have tried the map it's pretty easy it's a one star map you guys i'm pretty sure we're gonna be able to beat it um but that's the pet right there and you guys can see it it looks pretty cool so let's go ahead and go ahead and try to all right guys we're here at the voting screen so it's the moon shard valley it's difficulty is easy. It, I, I, for me, I think it's really easy. It is harder than the easier map on Zorbon. So I'm, that's what I am going to say. But this is definitely easier. It says take on the Moonclaw and the otherworldly and treacherous terrain of Moonshard Valley. So we're going to be taking down this boss. And I'm going to be showing you guys how. Alright guys, so we're going to change to our normal difficulty. Whoa, just looking at it, look at this map, you guys. Like, I really like it. Like, hold on, let me go ahead and place the tower. Um, do right there. Okay, that's good. So, this is pretty cool. Whoa, the pink. Whoa, so I have played this map a few times, but I haven't really looked around. Whoa, this looks really good. Look, look, I love this. Gr Wait, this grass? Like, it's like blue grass. This is really cool. I love. Wait. The colors match my suit, now that I think about it. It actually matched. So this suit is perfect for this map. I really like it. So I'm at level 45 on this suit. I'm leveling up pretty good. Oh, it just looks really, really good. Like, it just really does. All right, so let's go ahead and go back over here. So that's where our base we're trying to defend so that they don't get to. That looks really cool, The WD for World Defenders. That looks really good. I really liked what they did with the, the map. It looks really good. Alright, so we're going to sell him, and we're going to place down a Hercules, so I'm going to place him right there. And like guys, like I said, I bought this new Money Bags pet. It's really cool, I love the little dollar sign effects on it. And what I like about it is that it gives you a free blaster, like I said, this one right here. This one right there, it's really cool, it's fully golden, which is like, I've never seen a golden, well, the Golden Panther actually is a blaster. Now that I think about it, it's actually pretty golden. But I really like having another blaster to try out. And this one, in my opinion, 
I think it's definitely better than the Panther run. Uh, which, because it does 12, like, it does 12, but with the boost, it can do up to 15, like, just in one, like, one blast, so it's pretty cool. So, see how loud it is? Hold on, guys, sorry, ready? And then, you hear the little register, that's so cool, but of course, you don't really need your blaster for this one. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, if you just have a really good starter, it's just gonna go well, but if you want to kind of save up, like, for example, Hercules, you could have just blasted, of course. It would have been fine either way. So, for my strat, I'm just going to do two Hercules, level them up to tier 3. And then, that's when I'm going to get Shadow Claw. I, I want Shadow Claw to do the only work here, guys. We're going to see if Shadow Claw can take down this map by itself. Because, of course, it is a one-star map, guys. I believe the boss has 3 million health? Something like that. 3 million health. I think that's about what it has. Shadow Claw is a really good tower, guys. Of course, you can take down the boss much quicker if you just add more towers. But I actually haven't used Shadow Claw yet. I'm excited to use it now. I'm looking around to see my placement. Because Shadow Claw is a really big tower. Like It could take this whole entire space right here. It's a pretty big tower. So I'm going to do 15. There we go. So I hope everyone is having a great day today. I kind of wanted to hop on World Defenders. I saw that there was a new map. Wanted to try it out. And guess what, guys? I got the Moonclaw boss pet. It looks really cool. It looks really cool. But like I said, Moonclaw versus Shadowclaw. I thought that would make a really cool video. So that's what we're going to do. And if you guys want to know how to get Shadowclaw, it costs 2,500 gems. Uh, not the cosmic ones, but the normal ones. It's in the store. So you guys can also do that. You guys buy it there. And uh, I grinded really long for that. And I also grinded really long for money bags, actually. It costs 5,000 coins. But, of course, you get the co the money money blaster. So I thought that would be pretty cool. So I'm going to actually upgrade him. Tier 2. Alright, there we go. So we have Tier 2. Now, so, guys, we're going to continue to make a few more upgrades and then I'm going to see what else I'm going to place down. Alright, I just upgraded this Hercules to tier 3. We're going to do the same to this one as soon as I get the money in. There we go. There we go. So we have two tier 3s. My next plan is to sell both of them after this wave is over. Like, fully, after this wave is fully over. I'm going to sell these two and put a Shadow Claw. I'm thinking of putting a Shadow Claw up. Wait, could I put both of them up here? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Let me try to put a tower up here. So... Let me try, like, another Hercules. Oh, wait. Oh, guys, we might. Okay, so think about this, okay? We have Moonclaw here, and then we have the Shadow Claw up here, just beaming down. Oh, okay, okay, that's going to be really cool. We're going to try that. We're going to try that, see if we can. Oh, actually, this wave just got over. So we're going to have. Boom. So we got the Shadow Claw down. There we go. Uh, so, like I said, we're going to have it up here, but for now, we're going to keep it down here, and the reason I say that is because the range up here, I think I'm going to need to upgrade it, uh, upgrade it before I can actually place it up there, because the range is going to be so kind of small, like, up there, that it's not going to reach the track, so I want to make sure that we have the Shadow Claw being able to reach the track. Oh, guys, you know, I just got a great idea. So, you remember, you guys, I, last video, I mentioned that you can, it's a little glitch, but you guys, of course, you don't need it to win this map. It's probably one of the easiest maps. You don't need to do this. But there is a glitch. So, if you, uh, like, for example, place a tower down. So, for example, Shadow Claw's tower limit is two, right? So, it's two, right? And so, if you click really fast, you can place three. So... Imagine so Shadow Claw does fifteen thousand in total. So so like for example, if I place this Shadow Claw right here, right, and I and if I click, so it works. Sometimes I have to be really fast. It might not work, but if I place it down and click it really fast to Shadow Claw again, I should be able to get another Shadow Claw. So I'm gonna place this down. Oh, uh, I didn't do it fast enough. I'll do it a little later. But if if you do uh, like place it and then click it again really fast you can actually place a third shadow claw down but like i said guys you don't need it for this video i actually want to show you guys how that would look 
Uh, but I am going to sell it. That way I can show you guys how to do it with just two. But that would be, so that's 15, 15, that's 30. Then if it's another 15,000, would be 45,000. That's a lot. That's a lot. So having that much at a boss, that's pretty good. And so, but I just need to, of course. I just need to. We are going to put Shadow Claw up here. Meanwhile, though, we will have to upgrade these just so that we can get by on the rounds. What I will say, though, that this one star map has longer waves than the other one star. So this one has 25, and the other one star one has 15. So this one is a bit longer. Maybe that's what makes it a bit harder than the normal one star. But I think you guys can still beat this one. I think it's pretty easy to beat. It gives you more money, of course, so you can definitely upgrade and do a bunch more with it. So, uh, I am going to put, oh man, I just really want to put a Shadow Claw up here. That would look so good. Like, putting it right there would be really good, that little area. So, I am going to put them up there. Uh, promise, guys, I will put it up there. But I am going to upgrade this one. So, this is his Tier 1. So, you see the Tier 1, of course. And now we're going to go to Tier 2. Ready? Boom. So now it has like spots, it's getting bigger. Look at that. Shadow Claw is getting way bigger. So now it's doing so it has 1750, but with the my pet boost, 2187.5. So normally it does 1000 and then 1250 with my pet boost. So you guys, if you guys don't know what a pet boost is, it's a thing you can put on pets. If you go if you click on the pet section and then go to the forage thing, you can purchase like it costs coins to upgrade it of course and then you can kind of like forge it onto any pet so guys go definitely check that out i think that's really good because like imagine look this does a thousand but it's doing 1250 that makes a big difference when you're playing different maps so it really does all right so we're gonna upgrade this one to its tier two. Oh, okay that looks so good so tier two there we go so we're gonna save up for their tier three so it costs two hundred fifty thousand for their tier three and they do four thousand with my pet boost that's really good also guys there is a win streak so there's a lot like i said guys happening in world offenders like for example if you notice on my slot bar right down below you see this little trophy we click on it and it says win streak so there's plus 25 percent plus 50 percent plus 75 percent and plus 100 percent it says win streaks are earned by winning multiple times in a single session that would mean guys like don't log off don't log off the game so like if you if, if i let's say i have a streak of two i would have a 50 percent right and so that 50 percent will go on to my gems and my coins so basically if i earn 50 gems it's going to give me another 50% of that, and that would be 25, guys. So you would get 75 gems with the 50%. So that's pretty cool, and it says here... Oh, actually, guys, we're about to lose. Hold on. Uh, 250. Oh, look at that. It looks like a raptor, does it not? It looks like bigger. Way more muscly. All right, so let's actually keep an eye over here. So we're going to look at it again. So it says, after each win... Your win streak will go up and you will earn extra rewards on your next turn. Once you hit four wins in a row, so that's 100% in a row in a single session, you will earn double rewards for any games played after that. Bonus rewards are only applied to currencies and XP. So currencies would be, oh, actually, hold on. Let me upgrade him. Boom. Look at that. That looks so good. Okay, so currencies, guys. Currencies is your coins, your coins, your stardust, because that's a currency, your gems, and your cosmic gems. So that would be your currency, guys, uh, if you guys were wondering what that meant. And so once I hit, like, for example, 100%, I would get still times to whatever I get, because 100% of that would be just another of it. So if I got 100 gems for this game, I would get another 100 gems because I was 100%. But then after that, guys, after you reach t streak four, you'll get double of everything. So it's just really good, guys, that new streak thing. And like I said, like, you will lose your streak if you log off. But, like, let's say that they have to, like, load the game or something and you guys are playing. They have these safe things where it will save your progress or something. Now this Shadow Claw, we're about to get it to tier three. So you see the Shadow Claw, okay? 
So this is oh tier four, sorry tier four, three hundred fifty thousand. Oh, oh wow, oh wow, guys. The oh the tail. Look at the tail. Oh, that is so good animation. The tail looks so cool. The oh you see this lava streak? That looks so nice. Okay guys, so here's what we're gonna do. So like I was telling you guys, so okay, okay guys, you wanna see the final tier. Let's do the final tier so I can show you guys. But here's the final tier. This is tier four. Final tier. Boom. Oh, okay, this guy's a beast. Look at it. he has lava. Like tell me that doesn't look cool. Like he's protecting me right now. Like look at me. I'm safe. I'm safe from anything right now. Look at this. Oh my. Okay, so we should probably put another one down. So here's what I'm going to show you guys the trick. So I'm okay, I'm going to put him up here. Okay. So I'm going to put him up there. Okay, you want to see the trick? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, I messed up. Okay, hold on. Let me try it one more time. It's it's hard to get it, guys. Sometimes you got to Oh, there we go. There we go. I got it. So and you also have to have enough. So like it costs seventy five thousand. So for this to work, you have to have at least seventy five thousand. I have two hundred thousand. So boom, and now we have three shadow claws, three shadow claws. So let me upgrade him up here. See now he can reach. He can reach. I thought he wouldn't reach. There we go. So he can reach from up there. Look at this, guys. It's a it's a it's a bug, guys. I am gonna put it in their Discord to let them know that it is a bug. But until they fix it, guys, you can use it. It's pretty cool the bug that it that that works. There's also sometimes that if if it's small enough, you can fit it like on the track or something. I don't know if if this it doesn't work on this one, but sometimes it you can put stuff on the track. It's just different bugs, you guys. And you guys are more than welcome to put it on their Discord. But I am going to be doing that that way. You guys, they know about the bug. But look at that. So if you click really fast, you can have an extra shadow claw. That's three shadow claws. Look at that. So I am gonna upgrade them all to their max so i'm gonna get this one oh the boss is here the boss is here well okay you guys i'm gonna sell this of course you don't need this one to win so i am gonna sell it just so that i can get this oh look at the okay i have to upgrade i have to upgrade 750 okay look at this boss like i said guys look how good that looks from up there like it's just it's just the king the king is beaming down look at this oh that is so cool so this is our boss. Look at that. So Moonclaw versus Shadow Claw. Um, I'm pretty sure Shadow Claw is gonna win. It's like, look at that. That's just he's breathing lava. That's fire. Like, that's so cool. Also, guys, I'm gonna upgrade this fully. And guys, the the money blaster. When you upgrade all the way, it does like almost enough to take down like so someone with like seven thousand five hundred health. Like, it's actually that good. It sounds like coins. It sounds like coins. That is so cool. But yeah, it's a pretty cool blaster. Uh, oh, okay. Hold on. Let me actually. How much? What's your range? Let me sell you. But like I said, guys, you don't need uh, the third shadow claw. If you guys want to use it, you guys are more than welcome. It's just gonna take the boss down faster. I'm not gonna use any other uh, any other tower. I want to see if shadow claw can beat this boss. And it looks like it's almost it's almost down. We're gonna be able to beat this boss. I am sorry, Moonclaw, but we are going to beat you. And look at look at the pet. It just looks so cool to the to the boss. And just like that, guys, we have beaten the boss. We got the egg. We got the stardust. There we go. Okay. We also have our rewards, thirty-five gems. Like you can tell, guys, the UI is different. Look at this. Just the screen is just different. The way they made this, the currencies, and then of course our XP. There we go, 216, add it up down there. That's really cool. I love the way they made that, guys. Let's head back to the lobby, and I'm going to show you guys one more surprise. All right, guys, so we just made it back here to the um, the planet base. So what's really cool now, guys, oh, whoa, they have a giant Zorbon? Oh, okay, that has to be the coolest thing I've ever seen. So that's the Tier 5 boss on planet Zorbon, and then planet Galaxy that still has more bosses to come. Oh, guys, look, this is a new premium tower that they have. That's pretty cool. And then if we can open the egg, we're going to go over here. We're going to open our egg. What do we get? Oh, another another baby. Okay, so that's another one we have, guys. I think we have a few of those. 
Uh, oh, Astro. Astro Army. I think that's going to be really cool. Uh, also, guys, I want to show you something. So, if you look at the bottom screen, bottom left corner, you see something that says, like, a little present that says claim. So, if I look over here, they have a new thing, guys. So, let me claim this. Boom. Boom. And in nine seconds, I'll be able to claim more. So, there's this thing now where this called my bucks. And so, guys, they wanted to make, so, you know how, guys, I play free-to-play? Well, now they have a playtime store. So, these are all Robux towers that I'm looking at right now. They're all Robux towers. But you have a chance of getting them if you get enough bucks. So, I have 200 right now. The one I really want right now is Cyclops because he's the amazing starter tower, guys. Definitely save up for him. You can almost beat every single map with this starter. He does 350, guys, as soon as you place him down. And he starts with a 6,000 placement. So he's really cheap, easy to put down, and easy to win a lot of games. So, guys, I need 1,750 bucks, but he costs 800 Robux. So, guys, that's a way you guys can start earning new towers. And, like, for example, this one right here, special offer premium tower. After this has been released for a week, this will be in the playtime store, guys. So be expecting that. That's going to be really cool to have. Um, definitely, guys, if you guys play free-to-play, continue playing it because you guys are going to get free stuff. And speaking of free-to-play, let's go to our season pass. Guys, we made it to tier 17. Unlock this tier to receive a mega pet token to use on any pet and progress onto tier 8. So we're going to unlock it. Boom. We're going to unlock this one, too. Oh, guys, I, I'm going to change it to my Cosmic Gem. So I have 317. I'm actually going to convert the ones that we got today. I'm going to also get some more there. Okay, so now we have 452. We're going to buy some more. So I have a tier 19. We're going to unlock that. Okay. Oh, we get another egg. Okay, and then can we get that? No, we cannot. So we're at tier 21. We're doing really good. But this is what I'm excited, guys. We, this costs 800 Robux. But, guys, you don't need, uh, you don't need Robux to, to get that. You can get it in the tier pass. And now I have to decide what pet I'm going to make, like, really mega. And so my decision was that I spent, like, 5,000 coins on this little money bag spent that why not make this one the one that's going to be my, like, my mega pet. So now we're going to go to our pets. We're going to go to my little Monopoly guy. I like calling him my Monopoly because he looks like him. Uh, so here we go. Right down below, we see the red little bar. It says Mega. So we're going to click it. We have one. Spend one Mega Pet coin to make this a Mega Pet. Yes. Okay, guys. This should be Mega. I'm very excited. This is a Mega Pet. Guys, so let's see how this is going to look. Let's give a countdown in three, two, one. Let's find out. Whoa. Money bags. He's huge. Look at this guy. Oh, he has a bigger mustache now. Oh, wait, we can. No, we can ride money bags, guys. If we just tap him. No, wait. Hold on. Let me take off my suit. Hold on. We just tap him off again. Hold on. Let me take off my suit. The animation to tap. That is so cool, guys. Look at money bags. He looks so cool. Wow. So, guys. That is definitely the best way I'm going to end off this video. Money bags as one of my first mega pets, guys. Comment down, money bags, guys, if you made it this far into the video. But you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you guys to learn how to beat that map. I hope you guys can like and subscribe. And guys, stay tuned for the rest of my videos. Comment down anything that you guys want to see on other towers. Maybe you guys have questions, I'll answer them. Or even make videos on them, guys. But guys, till next time. Bye!